Well, look what I finally got my little grubby hands on. That's right, the Key Lime Slime Oreos. I have been looking high and low for these. You can ask my children. I've dragged them all over God's green earth just to find these things so I could review them for you guys. Just for you guys. Anywho, I'm not going to review them tonight. You know why? Because I was walking around the store and then this fucking happened. Holy shit. Yeah, balls. What the fuck? How did I not know about this? White fudge marshmallow Twinkies. I love white chocolate, white fudge, whatever. Um, I love Twinkies. And I love marshmallows so much. <laughs> I wish I could get marshmallow. Now that would be a nice Oreo. Give me a marshmallow Oreo. I'd like. You know, I'm going to make one. We're going to make one. We're going to do it. Got a new interesting little segment coming up probably early next week. Uh, it's called Overanalyze This, where I'm going to overanalyze different things, uh, mundane things, things that don't matter. For example, uh, the first thing we'll be uh, overanalyzing is a butter knife. So I hope you guys check it out. It's going to be a fun little program. Just having fun doing stuff, you know, man, getting back into the swing of things. <laughs> okay. Uh, I have chosen... To review the, these tonight. Why? Because I'm really not looking forward to eating the key lime slime. Uh, chances are I'll probably end up recording both of these tonight. I don't know. We'll see what happens. But <laughs> right now my mouth is watering for these. I really want to try these things out. These have the shittiest packaging too. Oh. Yeah, I guess you couldn't really do a flap with these. They're not very flappable. You can't flap these. You know, I'm starting to be very concerned about this new Ghostbusters movie, by the way. Let me just say this for a minute. First of all, the theme song by Fall Out Boy. I know they tried. They probably tried really hard, but... Oh, no. No, it just didn't work for me. It did not work at all for me. Uh, second, I have no problem with the cast. Or the, you know, I'll be interesting to see how the movie pans out. However... I've noticed that at uh, Target, all of the new Ghostbusters toys, brand new, just hit the shelf. The movie's not even in the theaters yet, are already clearanced out. Yeah, that's fucking crazy. It's not going to... Anywho, uh, let's see what we got. Only in theaters. Uh, I thought it gave the date of when it's coming out. Nine individually wrapped. We've talked about this before, haven't we? Why would you do nine? Just do ten. Why wouldn't you do ten? Doesn't that make sense? Of course they're going to save money by doing nine. If that's the case, do eight. Eight makes mo so much more sense. Round numbers. Why would you do nine? The fuck does nine anything? I'm just gonna rip open the box. All right, we got one. All right. <laughs> well, I got you here. Let me just read you a few of the ingredients: sugar, water, high fructose corn syrup, bleach enriched wheat flour, wheat flour, niacin, ferro sulfate, iron, thiamine, uh, mononitrate, riboflavin, folic acid. Doing good so far, huh? <laughs> Corn syrup, animal and vegetable shortening, tallow, hygienated tallow, oh, <laughs> cottonseed I'm oil, mono, and minute. diglycerides, polysorbate, Wait. 60, uh, lecithin, I think that's what it is, nonfat, dry milk, dextrose, contains 2% or less, soy, lecithin, 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 let's go with that. Eggs, sucrose, modified corn starch, baking soda, natural and artificial flavor, sorbic acid and potassium, sorbate, uh, to retain freshness, of course. Modified corn starch, <laughs> cellulose, gum, sodium, uh, sterol, uh, lactate, uh, lactate uh, xanthan gum, monocalcium phosphate enzymes, yellow number 5, red 40, barley malt extract, corn grits, contains wheat, eggs, soy, and milk. Well, that was a mouthful. <laughs> okay. Alright, let's bust into this. Let's smell this shit. Mm. No, no, nothing to smell. Mm. Okay, yeah, I definitely smell white chocolate now. I'm just going to pop a little bit out the end. Just, I just want to try the tip, you know, just... Uh, <laughs> oh. Mm. Mm. oh, yeah, Mildred. Mm. 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 Oh, this is everything that I hoped and dreamed it would be. Way beyond better. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's not that I don't have faith in Hostess, but their products aren't the highest of quality, and after reading all those ingredients, you know half of this is all chemicals. Or something, I don't know, worse. <laughs> Some alien DNA. What do you think? What do you think is in here? What would your ingredient list be? Put that in the comments below. A little bit of hate and regret. <laughs>
yourself together, man. Mm. Oh, you can wait while I enjoy this. I'm not even going to edit this out. Fuck you. I don't mean fuck you. I'm, I'm happy to have you here. Mm. <laughs> When you get a when you get a good big chunk of it in your mouth, it almost thickens up like a um like a funny bone. Wow, that was really good. Yeah, don't worry about spending the two fifty on those. Get those. That's such a surprise too. I don't know where the hell this came from. Of course, I knew the key lime slime. I know Twinkies has been doing usually two variations at a time. Usually they'll do like a seasonal one. Right now they're doing the 4th of July themed ones. And they're doing um, the banana split ones. Limited edition again. <laughs> so usually they're hand in hand. Flavors, uh, they're donuts too. Like uh, strawberry cream is one of their, you know, like their powdered donuts right now. And the other one is, I don't know, watermelon testicles or something. Oh, man. Now I'm going to dread trying that other one. Oh, my God. The key lime slime it just sounds vile at this point. <laughs> just disgustingly vile. But I'll do it. To save you $2.50. Or at least give you my opinion on the matter. Uh, anywho, what's on the menu tonight? It has been these white fudge marshmallow Twinkies. All right, so i got to rate them. I haven't done the whole rating for Twinkies in a while. Um... I mean, that's top end of the spectrum. I can't imagine one that I would like. I would like more. I'm gonna give it a ten with an asterisk. That's right. I like them that much. They're possibly my favorite Twinkies of all time. And there's a lot of good Twinkies. Chocolate owls? God damn it! Ooh, that's just good. But these are for me. For for all the flavors, I like the subtle, um, kind of nurturing flavors. You know the flavors that not like um. Spicy food is not a nurturing flavor. It might be uh, a uh, reminiscent flavor. It might be a nostalgic flavor. But it's not a comforting, cozy. I don't think. Maybe if you're born in Mexico or something. I don't know. Anywho. But when I taste this, I feel like I'm being swaddled for the first time in, you know, well, a lot of years. <laughs> it's just like, hey, hostess wants to give you a little hug. They sent you a little hug. There it is. Hope you love it. <laughs> 10 with an asterisk. Okay. Thank you guys for checking these out. Anywho, if you're loving watching these as much as I'm loving making them, please subscribe and pass them along to anybody who you know who might like watching them as well. Also, comment and like, share. You know, it would be appreciated. You don't have to. You really don't. It would be nice, though. What goes around comes around. Is that what they say? Wait a minute. That sounds vengeful. That's not what I meant. Uh, any <laughs> Follow me on the social media. It's always at G-E-Y-C-E-N. What do you think about that, huh? Get a little sick of that. Get a little sick of you. You heard me. Um, <laughs> don't forget to make somebody smile tomorrow. Make yourself a better person tomorrow than you were yesterday, tomorrow afternoon sometime, if you get a chance. <laughs> live life to the fullest and love every moment of it, because you just never know when that last moment's going to come for you. But don't live in fear of that moment, okay? Live in love and never let your inner child die. It's important. It is. Always be young at heart. And eat Twinkies at 41. Goddamn 1030 at night. On a fucking Friday. <laughs> Party on, dudes. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> take care of yourselves. Take care of one another. And take care of those around you who can't take care of themselves. Because they really need a helping hand. You know what? Is it so bad to lend a helping hand when you see somebody that needs help? Hey, man. Don't judge and I won't. <laughs> Sing and dance, my brothers and sisters. Thank you guys for always stopping by and checking these out. Uh, I'm Jason Oliveira. This is what's on the menu tonight. And I'll see you guys a little bit further on down. Where? The road. <laughs> Something witty. Good night. <laughs>